Happy day, friends. Hopefully your guys' daylight savings is going as smoothly as ours is with two kids, two and under. I know sometimes it can be tough. Thankfully this year, it's been great. It's been wonderful. The girls, uh, Austin and I didn't go to bed last night until, cause we had a date night. So we didn't go to bed until, gosh, it was probably 12.30, almost one. And I know Austin was up, maybe getting work done. I think he thought of some last minute work around two o'clock. So technically he was up until three with daylight savings, but the girls slept in until nine o'clock, right? Is mm -hmm. about nine o'clock, which was. No, they slept in until eight. Uh huh. Which is technically seven. Okay. But then they played for an hour. Both of them did. Paige played in, in her crib. crib quietly, and Micah played in her room quietly for an hour until nine. Micah, you are just amazing. You're so awesome. So we've had a quiet, chill morning. Not too early. Clearly, not early. Um, <laughs> it's. <laughs> It's been really wonderful. I almost feel bad telling you guys because I know that so many of you probably struggled today getting up an hour earlier than normal. Man, it makes me feel bad sometimes. <laughs> but I guess, but here's the thing you guys, like when things are really chaotic here, we don't always grab the camera. It's not that things are never like wild and crazy and just like overwhelming and too much. It's that when those times are happening, the last thing on our minds is grabbing the camera most of the time. So just know that as quiet as our morning has been, it is not always like that. <laughs> and if you follow me on Instagram, you'll see I posted some pictures of what was happening right here. A sweet little daddy daughter cuddle session. Oh, Austin totally fell asleep and I posted, I posted some pictures. I don't think he's even seen them yet. Do you like your new purple truck? That was on the mac and cheese box. It's cleaning. Is that cleaning truck? Hmm. Guess we won't be playing with that very much longer. <laughs> Don't you judge me. <laughs> We've all been there. Trust me, we have all been there. <laughs> Austin is over here trying on his new clothes. <laughs> I'm loud and I'm proud, baby. <laughs> I'm like really feeling like we need to go to Hawaii right now. He was like, I need a pineapple in my hand. Legitimately though, I would not wear these two together. Why not? You You're... even said, wow, well, that's a bit I know, much. I told him, it is a bit much, but it's growing on me. I told him like he needs to just go all out. He said, only if you get me one of those hats. And I said, deal. So, but you are full on Hawaii I'm tourist. I'm digging this, hat, this shirt. I might wear this shirt multiple times in the summer. You better. You bought it. Like, I love it. <laughs> <laughs> Is that like super dad of me? I mean, it's it's really fun. Like, next I don't know thing if it's I'm dad be, or not, but I think you know, it's really fun. Wearing new balances all greened up and. No, this is like fun dad. This wearing is like. Cargo shorts. This is like hot dad. Yeah, you talking. That's what I'm talking about. I like that. Get over but here. But these. I mean. These are awesome. Don't you Godzilla, hate on these? Godzilla White riding riding on a Jet Ski? I actually really love them. I'm the one that kind of pointed them out. They are awesome. Look, look, They're really fun. Like without the crazy loud shirt, those are fun. Those are way fun. And also these naked legs right here. Yeah. They're baby. not patchy. <laughs> no, they need to get tanned. I had to trim them, okay? We had to wax <laughs> squares of my legs. I'm not going to be walking out of square legs. Patchy legs <laughs> to match your patchy yeah. beard. Yeah. I'm just kidding. You're digging it, aren't you? It's growing on you, Let's aren't it? Isn't freaking it? freaking <laughs> go. Where's my pina colada? What do you think you're doing, little miss? Hi, little missy girl. Fuck. Ooh, that was a It's okay. Come here. You're okay. It's okay, sweetie. You're all right. You're okay. You're strong. You definitely bonk your head more than Mike ever did. Her book. She'll be fine. Yeah. <laughs> no, she'll be. Here's your book. So because of things like that, Paige has like three little red spots on her head right now from like the past two days. It's not even been very long. She's just trying to do a lot of new things, trying to stand up, trying to like lean on things. She is just being an adventurous baby and she's getting bonks on her heads. And I don't think Micah had like a bonk on her head, like a visible 
mark for 15 months. Like, I, I don't remember Micah ever really bonking her head on things. Micah was just content. Just yeah, I'll just potato. sit here. I'll just not do much. I'll just play with what I have. And Paige is so different. It's so fun seeing the differences between them. And, oh, actually, we have a clip from it. The other day we went out to the restaurant. Paige was just sitting there, patting on the table, having fun, taking little bites of her biscuit. I'll include the clip of it now. Hi, Paige. Hi, Paige. <laughs> and Austin was saying like how much he loves this stage and that this stage that she's in right now is almost making him reconsider the amount of kids that we have um, because Austin in his mind he was always like yeah two's good two's fine why are you throwing me under the spotlight right now? Because you were talking about it, and that's like a big change for you. Like, yeah. Well, it was just because she was being so cute, and it's just all the little things that... You're going to make me emotional right now. I hate you. Really? Yeah. Aw, continue. No, I love I'm when like you cry. Emotional. When you cry, it makes you seem more human. What do you mean? I'm not a robot. <laughs> no, you're not. I feel like we don't get to see what's inside the brain of a lot of dads because it's always like hush hush you know guys the whole masculine oh we don't feel things you know like and and I think you've done a really good job like opening up about how you're feeling and yeah. so how are you feeling we're know. gonna dig inside the brain of Austin <laughs> just thinking about how old Mike is just I don't know makes me sad <laughs> But, like, what about it made you feel like you wanted to have another kid? Just... It goes by too fast, huh? Huh? You know, she backs me up and says, yeah. <laughs> but... Oh, she just says book. <laughs> she loves books. I don't know. I just... It's so shortly lived that I want to... Almost like I want another round of it. Mm -hmm. That makes sense? I don't yeah. know. I don't know. There's a lot to consider. I think, too, we're getting to the point where we feel like two kids is manageable, right? Like, it's busy, and it's overwhelming at times, but we feel like it feels like our new normal, you know what I mean? Is that... I mean, at least that's how I feel. I feel like we're getting into a normal again <laughs> after nine, ten months. <laughs> but... Yeah, I mean... I, that's what goes through my mind. I still don't want to, like, rush into our next baby. Oh, yeah, we're not ready I'm yet. I'm still enjoying Paige, but like I've said in the past, that door is shut. It's not locked, but now I can kind of, like, almost see the door kind of, like, creaking open. Yeah. Because, of possibility, not of... <laughs> yeah, I get you. Like, I don't know. I just... I don't want this stage... Uh, <laughs> I don't want this one to be the last one, I don't think. Aww, that's huge for you. Now we have to get myself on board. <laughs> Just yeah. kidding. Just need to get you drunk, that's all. <laughs> I really think, like, the more, the more time goes by, the more we feel like, okay, we could... We, not, not just that we could do three kids, that we kind of want another at some point in the future which is crazy because after Paige for a while I was feeling like I can't do this again like how, how are we gonna ever manage but it, but you do like you get used to your new normal and then you start thinking of of options and of possibilities and how things would look like adding more to your family so I think that's where we're at I think we're like okay 
maybe we could and maybe we should add more to our family. It kind of feels right. Not not saying that this is the right time, but it kind of feels right, which is hey, like comforting is in a way. You say this is the last one, but she's already helping me fold clothes. You're doing great. <laughs> Does that come on your hand? <laughs> she is trying to fold clothes with you. She's very observant. She, she is, huh? Look, she's trying to put it on her foot. What are you doing, Paige? Hey, look. <laughs> Making mess of throwing laundry all over That's the place. That's fine. I don't even mind. I know. Aww. Are you sharing with Paige? Are you? That's so nice. And Paige is sharing with you too, huh? You are being a great big sister. <laughs> Aww. What is silly? You're just being silly. They love this stuff. Bomba. I've only recently seen it at Target, but we got it in one of our food box videos that we did on, I think, Mentri, or was it Ladies and Lattes? I can't remember, no, I think it was Mentri. It was from Israel, and they, they say that Israel has the lowest peanut allergy rates in the whole world because of this. It's oftentimes baby's very first food, it's peanut butter puffs, and, and the more that you expose them at an earlier age, to peanut butter, the less likely they are to have allergies. And so Israel has like the lowest peanut al allergy. And I saw it at Target the other day and I was like, oh, I have to get some. It's pretty dang good. I, I really enjoy them too. That's what they look like. Just little like puffed snacks. Honestly, they remind me a lot of Reese's Puff cereal. That's kind of what it tastes like. You don't have one too. I had one too. We're all sharing. Mm -hmm. Sharing can be pretty fun, huh? Right? Can I have another one? Um, um, I want to share with me. This one's for us. Oh, this one's for me? Hmm. Could you reach one? Reach and get one for me? Thank you, sweetie. I get three or four? Thank you so much. I love when you share. It makes me happy. Look how happy everybody is. Enjoying our bomba. Nom 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 nom. <laughs> you love them, Paige, huh? Yeah. You absolutely love them. Mmm. Nom nom. Nom 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 nom. Thank you for sharing. Thank you for sharing. Mmm. Nom 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 nom. Nom 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 nom. Thank you for sharing. <laughs> She's being silly, huh? I think you girls could use some milk. You want some milk? Is that a good idea? Great idea? Thumbs up for a great idea. Thumbs up. Thumbs up, dude. <laughs> and I'll also add that it's in the baby food aisle, at least at my Target. I find it in the baby food aisle. I don't know if they have it in the regular food section. So, if you can't find it, that's probably where it is. Hey, it's okay to say you're welcome for the sun, the stars, the sky. It's okay, it's okay, you're welcome to the soul to die. Say it's okay, you're welcome. What's that noise? It was the bathtub. Oh, it's the bathtub draining. It is the bathtub draining. I'm, I'm pretty surprised that you put two and two together. Chugga chugga choo choo into your mouth. Um, so, sad news, guys, as if Austin weren't emotional enough today, uh, Paige started standing in her crib, so we dropped that baby another 6 or 12 inches, however low it goes. Is that the lowest setting now? She is still standing up in it, but at this height, I don't think she'll be able to, like, climb herself over for... A while longer she still has like her her head barely goes to the top of the crib so I, I mean I'm sure kids have done it before but I don't see her doing that right now but goodness they are just growing up you are growing up oh I have to be quiet because Paige is sleeping I think it's almost your bedtime too okay deal okay I'm gonna say goodbye to everyone and then we can go bye <laughs> say, bye. Do you want to say bye? 
Say bye, friends. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching. Hope you're having a wonderful week. Week. Love you. Bye. Bye.